sitcom Mix Dish, the amazingly talented Erica Hamill plays a younger version of Tracy Ellis Ross's character from Blackish, and she wants to be recognized for her brains and beauty. Take a look. If you're wondering why this pageant thing was so exciting to me, it's because my progressive parents didn't want us girls to be raised to only value our looks. Oh, don't you look smart. Like a woman who knows how to balance her own checkbook. I understand where they were coming from now, but when I was 12, I just wanted to feel pretty. What if I win? Against me? <laughs> Please welcome Erica Hammer. Hey. So, welcome to the View. Thank you. And uh, you're you're out of New York City. You've been acting for a few years, but this is your first big gig. Yes. So I have to ask you, where were you when you got the news, and what were you doing? I was at Joe's Crab Shack. Oh uh, yes. Eating crab, yes, eating crab legs with my father, and he got the call. For my agent, and the next day we went to Disneyland. Oh, that's a very good one. nice. That's awesome. Very nice. <laughs> that's fun. The key key point is she has an agent. She had an agent. Uh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so um, this your show mixed ish. Yeah. yeah. It's a spinoff of uh, from the sitcom Blackish, and you actually play the teenage version of Tracy Ellis Ross Tracy Ellis Ross's character, right? Yes. Um, and I understand that um, Tracy has become your mentor. So tell us what Tracy has taught you. Uh, Tracy's taught me that, you know, not to worry so much about the imitation of the character because that's something that I was worried about, you know, nailing it. Uh. But, you know, to just bring myself to the character. Uh huh. Yeah, that was good. good. Any other advice she gave you? Um, you know, just being myself, which is a key message from her and also of the show. That's good. Mm -hmm. okay. Now, the show um, is about what it's like to grow up mixed race um, and how sometimes it's really hard to find your identity. What do you want people to take away from that? Well, I want people to know that, you know, no matter who you are or what you identify as, it's always important to just be yourself and don't be afraid. You know, people may judge you for who you are, but it's amazing to just be yourself. Mm -hmm. Have you experienced that, where people sort of want you to choose because you're mixed race? Yes, and I've felt that way. Yeah. But, you know, at the end of the day, it's just about being what you are and what you love. That's right, mm -hmm. yeah. Well, Mariah, uh, yeah, that deserves an applause. Mm -hmm. Wonderful advice, yes. <laughs> I love this. Mariah Carey was so excited for this show that she actually asked you guys if she could sing the theme song, and she did, which is amazing. Yeah. Yeah. Have you met her? I <laughs> saw her at the Ish event, the premiere, and I got to wave to her. I was super excited. Yeah. <laughs> That's it? Yeah. yeah. Mariah's got to step it up, man. You're starring in a show that she yeah. has the music for. Hopefully she can guest star in the yes. show. Oh, that would be, cool. be great. So the yeah. show set, it's back in the 80s. Yes. I was born in the 80s. Were there props? <laughs> Just to, well, no, because it, it, it takes me back when I see scenes like that. It like reminds right. me of my childhood. Are there props that you just have no idea what they are, or words that you hear? You're like, I don't even know that. Yeah, there was a scene I had to do where I had to put a tape in a boombox. Oh yeah, and a boombox. <laughs> oh, I God. wasn't sure how to do it, so I just I put the tape in, but it was still in the case. Oh no. <laughs> I was like, oh, is this how you do it? And the director was like, yeah, we're going to need to give you some lessons <laughs> on how to do it. Yeah. The 80s? <laughs> yeah. So. I love that. So have, you ever, had, um, have you ever seen a radio? Yeah. Yes. Yes. Oh, okay. Uh, now, yes. now. She had to think about it for a second. Oh, no. Yeah. We had uh, Marseille Martin on the show recently, who stars, of course, in Blackish. And um, she, she was here to talk about her movie Little that she also produced. She is 15, you're 14, and she has these big aspirations and is doing it, already producing. What about you? Are there other aspirations that you have at such a, a young age? Yes, I definitely want to direct and write uh, my own movies because ever since I was little, I would always make at home like little home movies of my cat and like my friends. <laughs> so it's definitely a dream of mine to do that. A director Are you now? Yes. Good. Yes. I love writing. Don't that's, stop. No, writing that's good. smart because it's you don't have to wait for them to give you the script. You have your own. Yeah, right. you yeah. create your it's own. It's the best way to now. stay in the business. Mm -hmm. And we've heard that uh, Ava DuVernay is someone that you look up to. Yes. Yeah, I think it's so boss of her to, you know, be her own director despite what any, anyone else might think. So. Mm -hmm. Has your life completely changed since you took this job? Like, do your friends still treat you the same? They do. Um, 
my life has definitely changed. How? Yeah. Well, you know, now I'm living in LA and not New York, and that's oh, that's different. Do like where, where do you spend the holidays then? Do you stay in New York? No. Uh, well, oh. here I'm now in New York for Thanksgiving, but for Christmas probably going to be in LA. So. Do you so like it there? I do, but New York is home. That's yeah. right. New York is home. Now, Megan earlier in the show was talking about how her dad outed her celebrity crush when she was 13. So now it's your turn. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I was going to say, do you no, have I'm a celebrity not crush? I'm let no. you ask that no. question. No, don't ruin it. Seriously, it'll ruin don't it. Don't ruin it. Don't I'm ruin like, it. Don't even, don't look at her. Don't ruin <laughs> it. <laughs> do not look at don't her. Don't ruin it. You come back, I suspect you're going to be going in all kinds of directions, yeah. and it's going to be great fun watching you. Thank you. Yeah. Our thanks to Erica Hemmel. Mix this airs Tuesday nights at 9 p.m. right here on ABC.